Hey everybody, it's Scott Steen with WinnersMinWiners.com. This Capper's Corner selection comes courtesy of Chris Kubala. He is the crusher over there at Winners and Winers, crushing those books. And today, he's taking a look as the Mets and Phillies get together at 6.05 Eastern start time. Sees the Phillies as a one, minus 166 favorite over the Mets, plus 153. 8.5 is your total there. Steven Matz goes against Aaron Nola for the Phils. And here is uh, the breakdown on that game. Uh, Steven Matz gets the call for his fifth start of the year for the Mets. Hoping to get back on track after a sluggish start. He comes in not good. Not good at all, Steven Matz, this season. 0-3 on the season. 8-2-0 ERA. 1.50 whip. Three walks. 18 strikeouts. Giving up a major league leading eight home runs over just 18 and two-thirds innings of work. He took the loss in his last start, which came on Monday. At home against the Nationals, four and a third innings, allowing eight runs in four and a third innings on eight hits, no walks, five strikeouts. In a game that the Mets ultimately dropped 16 to four. Aaron Nola, on the other hand, for the Phillies, doing making his fourth start for the Phils, uh, pitching very well this season, one and one on the year, officially 2.79 ERO ERA, and a very solid WHIP of .62. Two walks, 29 strikeouts in 19 and a third innings of work. He earned the win his last start Monday against the Braves. Eight innings, one run, two hits, one walk, 10 strikeouts uh, in a game that the bullpen tried to give away, but they uh, couldn't quite do it as the Phillies still won 13 to 8. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, fun fact here Mets are 0 and 6 in Mets' last uh, six starts versus a team with a losing record. So uh, he's not good, and he doesn't do well against teams that are not good. Uh, both teams have been inconsistent so far this season. Uh, that's something to be expected, given the way the season has played out. Uh, Nola has dominated the Mets in his career, and Mats has been awful in his four starts this season. Uh, giving up eight homers in 18 and two-thirds innings is certainly cause for concern, especially with the power that Philly, the Phillies have in their lineup. Until Mats finds a way to right the ship, You've got to fade the Mets. Mets have to be on auto fade here whenever Mats is on the mound. Take the Phillies at home here as Nola turns in a, another solid outing. So get yourself down on the Philadelphia Phillies minus the 166. And at the end of this contest, you can join the Crusher as you pick up your winning tickets and head back to the window. Good luck, everybody. Please don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. And, of course, don't forget to check out Winners and Winers for deep dives into every game going on in America every single day. Good luck on all your plays, and we will see you on the next video.